perfect. No, I'm not a writer. Okay. As you can see, mine is nice and simple, nice and small toothbrush. And the second thing you're going to need is your styling gel. Let me say that. I've got the Eco Styling Gel. As you can see, I've had it for quite some time because it's quite scratched out. And your third thing you're going to need is just a simple lid like of a container, whatever container that you desire. I got mine from my um, little ribbons. I use that lid. And then, your fourth thing you're going to need is a cotton pad. I just got this simple plastic of cotton pads. Just one. Alright. And then the fifth most important ingredient, most important thing you're going to need to lay your edges is water. I got mine in a spray bottle. And... Nice and simple. All right. Okay. So what you're gonna do first is you're gonna take a cotton pad. As you can see mine. Uh, you're gonna fold it in half, and then fold it in half again. You're gonna take your lid <laughs> and you spray your water inside it, or you can get your water from from the tap, whatever water you that you desire. And then you take your cotton pad right and you dab it you just dab it dab it dab it dab it oops dab it dab it dab it dab it this this method is quite important for people that have sort of rough hair you know if your hair is more than you know it's like your edges are quite rough and not smooth enough so especially for forcey hair so you just take this method of using the water and trust me it's gonna work so you take your little cotton pad and then you just dab it on the the edges that you want to to use Gonna take your your eco styling gel whatever gel that you actually want to use you're gonna take it and as you can see me i have little axes on the lids what i actually did was i took my finger and then i just took whatever i needed to use then i put it on my lid and then just remove the axis on the on the actual container just make sure that she just clean right just clean it off we don't want too much mess. So, you take a toothbrush, you just lightly dab it onto the gel, like that. Lightly, 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 lightly. Not too much, not too little. There you go. Okay. So, the most important thing in actually doing the technique of laying your edges is following through with your finger. So, I'm going to take my indexing finger or my middle finger. And then I'm going to take my toothbrush. Yeah, you actually don't need too much gel, you know, because it actually sprays out a lot. A little can go a long way. <laughs> so, yeah. So then you just do it like that. Just create, create your angle. Just like that. You can see. Nice and neat. Okay. Um, I actually draw it down. I draw it down. I just draw it south. And then I follow my finger through. And then I curve, right? Because I actually like my edges to be quite neat, you know? So we're going to draw it down. Draw it down. And then tuck it in. Just like that. 
you see that you just tuck it in to make it actually look very nice and neat <laughs> if you actually feel like um it's dried out because you took quite some time on the uh, on the first side you just continue just doing the same thing again spray some water onto your lid uh okay the whole point of actually using a lid is that i think for me personally i just find it neat you know, because in the beginning, I used to just go um, dab my fingers. Like, I used to wet my fingers and then I will just... But they were sort of messy. So, I just like the fact that it's in a container. I can just sit down and actually just use a nice cotton pad. And then wet it, you know? I'm a simple That is perfect. Just the way I like it, just like that. And as you guys can see, it just is nice and laid. And the fun thing about this is that you can actually do this in like two minutes, literally. And you don't actually have to use a scarf to actually lay down your edges, like most people recommend. And you actually, you're actually done from this. You can just go continue with life and do whatever you want to do. You actually don't need to sit down with your scarf for five to ten minutes. You can actually just continue with whatever you want to do and i hope you guys can just follow this tutorial and really enjoy how i did it thank you so much for watching my video i hope it really helped if you're new to my channel please subscribe like and leave a comment down below